tell us tell us leonard about the the economics the arithmetic of second and pre love books which are right behind us and it's a lot of hard work but uh, but i mean it's low returns hard work but also satisfying yeah and there are people who have given us their books saying that let them let them find a new home so we don't pay much for them okay but then we don't sell them for much either. okay we are trying to we, that's how we are making books accessible now you might say that you know but you're making money out of it but uh, we, uh, we think of ourselves as uh, that catalyst that allows books to because we've got some really good books here that you know are out of print hmm. like naipaul's entire collection we have and all these kind of books uh, and people are, and there are like i said people are saying just just take them and find them a new home right. in that sense you know what moves faster fiction non fiction any genre um no i mean in uh, whether it's for new books or used books i've not found any genre moving faster one faster than the other no uh, no not in goa I meaning it's 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 wisdom it's, it's it's the prevalent wisdom in india that non fiction moves faster i think that except that young couple who came over yesterday from bangalore uh-huh. and said that uh, fiction sells fiction sells but i don't know whether it's indian fiction Indian about. fiction they are talking about, but I generally am totally a non-fiction person. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so so also I think I think it's a reflection of the kind of literature that we like. We like and we are exposed to. So this was your original business plan when you started, no? Dog years. Right? So the dog years came from used books. Used books. But uh, slowly we realized that not many people. So we there are a lot of people like yeah. You know, like hotels yeah uh, uh customers come and uh, leave, leave their books behind yeah. and we buy them we buy those books yeah uh and um, so but but many people are reluctant to part away with their collections also so. it it's 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 not a very uh, remunerative field but it's a important field that's what you're yeah, saying yeah yeah and and uh, it's a for us it's not very remunerative because we don't uh, sell for much unless you select book house in bangalore which can make a whole model out yeah, of it but we are not doing antiquarian books yeah uh, but select also was not so much into antiquarian more into uh, used old books old books old quote unquote old books yeah but there the economics were totally different because you had anglo indians we are not we are not very we are not very discerning when it comes to the kind of books we okay. accept so that's why we have a lot of for example self help books that are just there you know okay. they have not sold for ages okay but then there's one customer who will come and say i want that book and then okay makes it worth it so it it also makes it a joy to visit bookshops when you have a lot yeah. of these kind of affordable yeah. so a customer is not going back without a book you know yeah he's not going back empty handed not going back empty handed it's good for us but also they also feel like okay i i bought a book i got something to read uh on my way back okay. yeah. yeah thanks thanks yeah.